Good morning, James. Hi, Eric. I've been using my typewriter for my work and it was very convenient, so I want to know how it works. Let me help you. This is how a typewriter looks like. These are the buttons. And they have got levers attached to them. Yes. I know those things. They are attached to bricks. Bricks? Yes. Bricks. They have the letters that you want to type written on them. Here is a sample of a brick. You can see that the letters are left to right turned. Why left to right? So that if it touches the paper, then the letter will come out the right way. I see. It is basically like a piano. If you hit a key, then a hammer will go down and hit the string and make some noise. Also, each typewriter has an ink paper that makes the letter go to the paper. And every typewriter has carbon tape on it that makes the paper go a little to the right so that you can type your next word. Then how can we make capital letters? Good question. The sheet of paper is rolled onto a cylinder-like place where the brick hits. Every time the brick normally hits the paper on the cylinder, the lower part of the brick hits it. But if we want it capital, then we should have the top part of the brick hit the cylinder. There is a special type of key called the shift key. It is called the shift key because it shifts the paper and the cylinder up. Once the paper is shifted up, then the top of the brick can hit it, making its capital letter hit the paper. That is a good explanation, boss. You like using the typewriter, right? Eric? Also, what about the bell that rings every time we finish line? Y yes. We attach a bell at the end so if we reach the end, then the bell will notify us that and we can start a new line. Thanks for teaching me how a typewriter works. If you have any questions, then please ask.